Hey, good morning, everybody. Welcome to another day of Mark Bar, brought to you by Mike Bjork. Today is Monday, May 11th. I hope you guys had a wonderful weekend, especially to you uh, mothers out there. Hope you enjoyed your beautiful day uh, on Mother's Day here. Hey, we don't got any economic news for the release that's scheduled for today, but this is the only day this week that's light, as the rest of the week will be a bit more impactful. There will be a lot of high-impact uh, uh, data coming out this week. And kind of mixing lines here, but today's stock market's a little mixed. Uh, some of it is profit taking uh, from Friday's gains. Uh, China's central bank did cut rates, but it's been kind of moved to the side. Uh, Greece ha is having their meeting with IMF, so if you recall back in uh, February, they kind of moved. Uh, kind of, all they did was just kind of defer to today, this month now, regards to the repayment of the IMF, and it's about 837 million, which is due tomorrow, and so they're meeting with them today. So. Uh, take one that this could be uh, a major thing this week with the investors uh, as this will probably take uh, you know a front page on everything uh, bond market we got uh, a downward after a nice little rebound on Friday Thursday Friday uh, it came down today so as a result of course rates are climbed up a little bit so again this is a little bit more profit taking hopefully we'll see a little bit more gains come back we'll kind of strike that hope uh, also, this kind of helps us out more of a healthy pur purpose because uh, what happened was when we opened up, we had a, a bit of a gap uh, that opened up on uh, Friday. So this, by closing this gap, will give us a little bit more solid foundation to move upwards. So this will help us out a little bit going forward here. Uh, hey, uh, to kind of touch base on what we've been talking about the last couple of weeks, so we got some new programs coming out here, which I'm very excited about. Uh, one of them is our Income Solutions Program, which is great for the self-employed borrowers. We have a program that will help with a maximum loan amount of a million dollars for self-employed borrowers. We can take uh, two years bank bank statements on their business bank statements to take uh, the average deposit and 50% used as qualification for income instead of uh, looking at tax returns uh, this will help qualify more people um, you know especially those who are pretty aggressive with their deductions to be able to qualify more with um, with their primary residences this is also uh, good for a lot of other things as well including non warrantable condos as well as for foreign nationals so these are a nice little product that we can uh, help out people uh, looking at bank statements in lieu of uh, bank uh, tax returns all right, folks. Hey, if you guys have any questions uh, about this program or anything about these uh, uh, blogs, feel free to contact me through my profile. I'll be more than happy to answer anything I can uh, help you guys out with. Have a wonderful day. Thanks for again for watching. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.